exit right there. I got some beans too, but we don't have electricity. Because we're stranded right now on the side of a road, middle of Switzerland. It's pouring rain. Everything's wet. Yeah, tell me about this sick road. <laughs> uh, the hills out here are incredible. The first time I went here was like 2011, I think, for greener pastures. And I want to come back ever since. Now we're back, but it's fucking soaking wet. <laughs> hey guys, I'm Louie the Lizard, and we're here today at Skate House to give you a little update on our P.O. Box and Photo Contest. <laughs> I moved to LA in fall of 2008. No one knew how to skate, like steep hills. It wasn't possible to skate everything like it is now. Um, we really had to figure out kind of like how to put our hands down and slide and control our speed around, you know, like tight canyon cliff corners. Skate house happened super naturally. There's five of us in the house at the time. It was like me, Louie, Brian Peck, Matt Kay, Max Dubler. And every day we had this like, we'd come home from skating, we had this sick helmet cam footage and we'd like sit there for the TV and watch it. We'd be super excited. After a couple weeks of doing this, we're like, man, we gotta like, I don't know, put this out there. I remember it really started when uh, Brian Peck, we were leaving to go skate and he's walking out the door and he just looks back. He goes, hey guys, we're gonna put this online. We should call it Skate House Media. And the moment he came up with that name, we we're just like, Hell yeah, let's run with this. And we were meeting with people from all over the world and on all, all kind of collaborating on our different styles and stuff. We were all kind of like had this idea of what we could do. And we all kind of tried to push and we all kind of like got to that level together, I guess. That was kind of like the training ground for a while. Still is, I guess. Nights along in search of a love. I don't even know how you're doing it, but you've got to put them high every time. Not Green underneath, and then you gotta go uh, two. Hey, other than that, pretty excited. T tell us why you wanted to film this road, James. I think some people might think it's unconventional for what you normally skate. Yeah, maybe. I guess people are so used to me skating like mountains and stuff like that. And I grew up here like close to San Francisco. So I always like bombing sidewalks and slashing driveways. Girl, somebody's watching. When you're walking down the street. Show the case that a little bit, I guess. I don't know if it's that cool or whatever, but you guys can check it out. <laughs> they want my old shit, buy my old album.
Oh, you motherfucker. <laughs> What's the question? Um, the monitor fall. Oh yeah, fuck. Half of me kind of sits here to, and say like, yeah, it was a fall, but you know, you gotta like get back up on your board and like fucking get at it, which is true. It's kind of what I did. Like that was during, we did that, that fall took place during our first day of filming and it took like two weeks, take two weeks off and then go back at it. But uh, I guess my point is like, I wish I could just say, you know, you fall and you get back on the horse and you keep killing it. But to be honest, falling at 100K, 60 miles an hour kind of takes a toll on you. I put my head down, finished filming for the pro model, and then just like, I don't know, I really had to like work my way back up to be able to skate fast again. I mean, but skating at, like downhill skating is so gnarly, and when you're skating like at a low level where you're like hitting 60 miles an hour every single day on your skateboard and like doing stand-up slides, that's a hard level to maintain. It's like if you don't skate for a day, you're kind of off the ball, and then you have to skate for two days to kind of get back to where you were again. I don't know, that fall sucked and it took me a while to get back to that level, but also maintaining that level is difficult and dangerous. <laughs> so tell me about how the filming's been going. Um, we're being optimistic. Ha! She smokes pot! Ha! She smokes pot! Ha! She smokes pot! Ha! She smokes pot! The sun's shining now, so we're stoked. At least we got that going. <laughs> Time to get some clips. Time to stack some clips. It's gonna be good. But this road's really fun. Uh, 
right here with a good crew. We got a camping spot like right on top of the road. So that's been chill. We had some good uh, like Swiss cheese and fucking wine and sausage last night. While it was pissing rain. <laughs> Doing the best we can. But you know, high hopes, cause we're in the high, high mountains. <laughs> in the high. You. I'm clean. <laughs> After three days, then it, they stink. Fuck. Ah. Yeah. <laughs>